Time to check out what's trending now. It was Hollywood's biggest night last night, and the 93rd Annual Academy Awards was full of surprises. And a shocking upset. Entertainment Tonight's Kevin Frazier has that story. Lauren and Elliot, this was an Oscars like no other, uh, with no host, a makeshift stage at LA's Union Station, and no orchestra cutoff of speeches. It truly, truly was a night of firsts. And the Oscar goes to Chloe Zhao. Chloe makes history. She's the first woman of color and only the second woman ever to win the Best Director. She also won the night's biggest honor, Best Picture. We give this one to our wolf. Oh! Chloe, um, first of all, congratulations on the win, but what was it like being out there with Francis howling at the moon? The howling is for our production sound mixer, Wolf. We unfortunately lost him recently. So that howling to the moon is for Wolf. And the Academy Award for Actor goes to Anthony Hopkins, the father. Anthony also made history as the Oscars oldest Best Actor winner, but social media was in an uproar. He upset the late Chadwick Boseman, the heavy favorite in that category. Anthony missed the show, by the way, but later gave an acceptance speech on Instagram. I want to pay tribute to Chadwick Boseman. <laughs> I really did not expect this. And the Oscar goes to Daniel Kaluuya, <laughs> Judas and the Black. Daniel won for Best Supporting Actor, his first Oscar, but it was this moment during his acceptance speech that went viral. Like, it's incredible. My mom met my dad, they had sex. It's amazing. Like, do you understand? I'm here. Daniel, have you had a chance to talk to your mom yet? Has she texted nah, you? No, bro. No, no. I'm going to avoid my phone for a bit, mate. Trust me. I'm going to avoid my phone for a bit. I think my mom's not going to be very happy. <laughs> and this is just the beginning of ET's Oscar coverage. Tune in tonight for more interviews with the winners, all the wild fashion, and everything you didn't see from the big show. You don't want to miss it. For Entertainment Tonight, I'm Kevin Frazier. For more on the Oscars and the day's Hollywood headlines, watch Entertainment Tonight at 7.30 right after CBS 4 News at 7.